already, did you? It started now. Thank you everyone for joining us tonight. We're putting out a spontaneous play and I hope you like it. We're talking about the story of the women with the issue of blood according to Mark 5, 25 through 33. And Miss Virginia is our actress. And Miss Carol will be reading the scriptures. And Miss Meridale is a camera person. So thank you for joining Hi. us and I hope you enjoy it. Miss Carol. Thank you, Miss Joy. Okay, I'm reading the book of Mark, chapter 5, verse 25 to 32. Now a certain woman had a flow of blood for 12 years and had suffered many things from many physicians. She had spent all that she had and was no better, but rather grow worse. When she heard about Jesus, she came behind him in the crowd and touched his garment. For she said, if I only may touch his cloth, I shall be made well. Immediately, the fountain of her blood was dried up, and she felt in her body that she was healed of the affliction. And Jesus immediately knowing in, in himself that power had gone out of him, turned around in the crowd and said, Who touched my cloth? But his disciples said to him, You see the multitude thronging you, and you say, Who touched me? And he looked around to see her who had done these things. But the woman, fearing and trembling, knowing what had happened to her, and came and fell down before him and told him the truth. And told him the truth. Okay. Action! <gasps> Oh, I feel so sick, Lord. I have been walking so many miles just to get here. When I heard about Jesus, they told me that Jesus is the Son of God and that He is the Savior and He can heal, He can deliver, and He can set the captives free. He can even save our souls. Oh, I need to not give up. I'm getting close to Him. <laughs> but there are so many people. And I am so embarrassed with my predicament. I'm bleeding all over. And I'm considered unclean. Well, I must press. I must press forward. <laughs> Only if I could touch the hem of his garment, I know that I can be healed. I know I can. But all my strength is coming out of me, and I feel like passing out. Lord, help me to get to you. For I believe that when I get to you, I can be healed. I am broke, God. I have no more money. I've been bleeding for 18 years. Maybe 15, but maybe 18. Somewhere around there. I spend all my savings. I go from one doctor to another doctor. But none of them can heal me. They only took my money. And I have nothing. And I am dying. Who can save me from death? Oh God, I am a helpless human being. I am hopeless. But I know that you are my chance. Only if I can get to you. Oh, I must press. I must not give up. Even if I have to crawl to the ground to get to you. Jesus, Jesus, let me touch, let me touch you, God. Oh, oh, oh. I need you, Lord Jesus. Without you, I am done. Give me a chance. 
give me a chance to live and I will serve you forever for the rest of my life. And I declare to the world that you are the Messiah and that you can heal the true Son of God. And the true Son of God, only if I could touch you, only I could touch you. Jesus! 